These are photos of Kate Hudson at the NYC premiere of Wish I Was Here, which is Zach Bruff's Kickstarter-funded Dreamady. You can see the trailer here. The film does feature Jim Parsons, which is always a plus. This is definitely a Zach Bruff production with plenty of dreamy music, hazy lighting, and inspirational sayings floating through the trailer. There's a pink wig reminiscent of manic pixie dream girl greatness. Never mind that the man who coined the MPDG apologized a few days ago for his creation. Kate is working her post-baby body at this premiere. I don't usually enjoy scrutinizing women's figures post-birth, or at all, but Kate has already opened the topic for discussion. She's co-founder of the Fabletics clothing company and works out six hours a day, versus dieting. Kate wants us to talk about her body, and no wonder. Her bod looks fantastic. This Michael Kors resort gown isn't amazing, but we can see Kate's midriff shining through. Eye on the prize. Here are some new excerpts from a parade interview, the scene where her character talks with a dying family member, that was an intense day. You can't help but think about that moment in your real life. You never want to look back and, feel you missed, that connection. She's doing more indie films, yeah, the bigger films haven't really spoken to me. But people like to see me in comedies, which I love, and I do want to make more comedies, for women, that are dumbed down. Her musical children it might be in our DNA. Bing, age three, has been musical since he was born. And Ryder, her ten-year-old with ex-husband Chris Robinson of the Black Crows, always finds the new bands, he goes, Mom, check this out. And the next thing you know it's a number one hit. For me, it's a passion, when you love to sing, it doesn't matter what you sound like it just makes you feel good. It's the universal language, isn't it? From Parade, Kate has been focusing on indie movies for the past year. She already made her money in studio rom-coms, and now she wants to prove herself as an actress. Remember when Kate was nominated for an Oscar after Almost Famous? She wants to achieve that greatness again, and I can't blame her. But she cannot disown my best friends girl, Fool's Gold, and Bride Wars. I'm including some photos of Ashley Green and Joey King. Ashley is wearing a Del Alexander McQueen dress with no pizzazz. Joey looks amazing in a retro-inspired moods of Norway dress. She's only 14, 